It's time for a DigiKey unboxing. Let's take a look at the DXM R90 from Banner Engineering. It's a flexible and customizable industrial controller for industrial IoT. So let's get started. Inside the box, you'll find the DXM R90 controller. You'll need to supply a 4-pin M12 to RJ45 shielded Ethernet cable and a 24-volt M12 power source. We're using Banner's STP M12D 406 cable and PSD 244 power cable. The DXM R90 fits into the distribute level of Banner's Snap Signal family. It consolidates, processes, and distributes data using industrial or web service protocols. The controller features a compact housing and IP67 rating for easy installation in any location and allows users to send data via Modbus TCP, Ethernet IP, Profinet, or HTTPS push methods to PLCs, HMIs, SCADA systems, or the cloud. It includes a 100 megabit per second Ethernet port and four independent Modbus client ports that enable simultaneous communication with up to four chains of Modbus server devices. Each chain can contain multiple Modbus server devices when daisy chained together. The two port zeros are configured as a Modbus server by default and support pass-through for connecting to a Modbus trunk. Connect the M12 to RJ45 shielded Ethernet cable to the controller and your network. Note that its default IP is 192.168.0.1, so your network setup will need to allow you to access that IP. Then connect the power. Launch Banner's DXM configuration software. Scan your network. Set the model to DXMR90X and connect to the controller. In the Local Registers tab, you can modify register settings or add action rules that provide local data processing. Once these are set, you can go to Register Mapping to set your port configurations and then create RTU read and write rules to gather data and configure sensors or configure Modbus TCP client communications. In Settings, you can configure system parameters, set up cloud services, including the Banner Cloud Data Services, change Ethernet settings, and enable Profinet, or upload MicroPython or Script Basic scripts for more advanced local processing. Once you're finished, send the configuration to the controller from the DXM menu in the menu bar. Now you're all set! Check out other products in the SnapSignal family to make IIoT easy. Thanks for watching.